this means the book form dot html we have to create yes yeah we are going to create that now okay i'll start sharing my screen just give me a minute can everybody run their run server command if in case there is some syntax issue or something it will give you an error i will also try to run it and i'll check i'll share my screen but you don't need me to tell you how to run run server command sir can you show your code again i have one error i need to check the syntax yeah just give me a minute i need one second to i'm checking something on the other screen so i need a minute to do that before i if your run server runs properly at least at the basic level you don't have any syntax error i will start sharing my screen again and uh, while i share my screen please create a book form dot html in the library manager folder inside template so create book form dot html in the same place where books dot html exists and wait for the next instruction sir i have written correctly the line number for canon i don't know what number you have but i am getting the error for de define uh, where it is sorry if request dot method uh, logically equal to post so what is the error can you paste it yeah yeah, yeah. i am i am putting the error same error which i had uh, previously uh, can you please paste it i don't know yeah i have pasted yeah again this is an indentation error it is possible that you are you have not added an indentation after the def line or yeah. maybe you have a tab here and not spaces or uh, there is no indentation after if uh, there could be multiple cases but basically yeah, everything is form so everything is correct i will share my screen one second mega can you please share the complete error and i can tell you what is wrong book forms file under templates under library manager it should be in the same folder where you have created books.html same folder as books.html just create the file there call it book form.html please make sure spelling is correct the spelling in your views.py code and your uh, html file name should be the same you can call it whatever you want to call it but the name should be the same in both places otherwise it will throw an error when you are running your run server so i have shared my screen can you please maximize yeah this one the if command is not indented same as the way i had written is, is it wrong yeah. Yes, the if should yes, be you need indented. To, you need to indent everything under def one more one more four space forward. Everything should go four spaces forward. Okay. So now you now you send if now you need to send everything under it also. Ah, huh. like this. Correct. Okay. is it okay now no now your return is too indented acha is it okay i cannot see that clearly but in that else in the else block everything should be in the same line yeah they are in the same line no they are not which your one form your form equals book form and your return is not in the same Okay, is it okay now? Now it should be okay. Hopefully, so this should not happen, I guess. So the L should be backwards, like in the line of the first if. No, no, it, it is for the second if. It's for first. It's for first. Okay. Right. 
you have to get back that form and everything on the else no, colon no. below the colon the funny thing is this will still work but yeah you should be able to arrange it properly otherwise later you will get confused but okay you can do it i'll stop sharing for now is it okay now uh you can compare with the i share my screen and you can compare yeah 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 i can do that yeah yeah correct Return. Right. The request to be inside. Yes. Okay. So, uh, because I also tend to not remember the HTML correctly, I already have it here. So I just, I just do some cheating and paste it in my HTML file directly and make some changes. Yes. But essentially, yeah, what what we are doing is open book form dot html and once you open book form dot html type out the following text which is a very simple html tag followed by a form tag followed by method equal to post csrf token form as table input type submit value submit this is the submit button for your forms i'll wait here as well for you to copy this please make sure that you are using the correct spellings capitalization curly braces percentage values etc and let me know once done sir can you show your code it is available yeah no no this one uh, views.py the last one first Oh. Okay, let's take it there. Yeah. Sir, book forms dot HTML code. So I'll send you the link. Um, it is the same code. I don't think I have to edit anything. I think I closed it. Sir. Oh my. No, no, not Ankit, not to you. Uh, the the Ananta Kulkarni sir had some indentation error. Right. Yeah, this one, sir. Uh, two brackets there. Ananta I mean, Kulkarni, yeah, sir. Yeah. These brackets are not required. It's all no. on the books. You need. You need square brackets. You need quotes around the names. That is, title should have open quote, close quote. Author name should have open quote, close quote. And bracket should be square bracket open, square bracket close. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let me try. Right. So, anyone who is finished writing the book form dot HTML, can you please save, and then we can move to URLs. So we fixed, we created a view. We created the HTML that ties to the view. we now need to make sure that the url that we are going to hit is set up and working correctly so these are the three main elements please tell me if you have done with the html page no still it is showing the invalid syntax for the if i change the brackets no then there's something else that is going wrong And it is uh, happening on a single line initially only. Sir, I am having a doubt here. Post that is all lower case or upper case because earlier it was all upper case. In HTML, the lower case is fine. Okay. Sir, all is round brackets, sir. I was talking about the fields, the fields that you mentioned in your previous error. Mm -hmm. They are supposed to have they are supposed to have square brackets. Okay, okay. In all books, they are supposed all should have round brackets. Okay. okay. I'll stop sharing my screen. Mega, if you want to share, you can share screen, or you can type the issue in the. Excuse me, sir. Can you please share views dot py? Yes, I'll share it in a minute. Just one second. I can't see what is happening. What there's an invalid syntax on some line, right? Twenty line twenty five. Can you show whichever line that is? Oh, 
Okay, which line is that? Can you tell me which line here? On text. Yeah, you are missing a comma here. So we are sending them multiple parameters. So request comma book form dot html quotation end comma on text equal to something comma. You need to have comma. Last comma not required, I guess. Fine. Okay. Abhijit, can you please post your yeah. error in the chat? And I'm it's pretty possible that we can solve it there itself. No need for. Sir, I am getting mm -hmm. undefined name book form and undefined name redirect. Yes, so you need to import book form from the forms page, the forms file. So, like you did from dot models import book, you'll have to do from dot forms import book form. Book form should use the same capitalization that you use when declaring the class. Similarly, you already have a line at the top that says from Django dot shortcuts import render. You can just add comma to the end and type in redirect there. So you are importing redirect and render from Django dot shortcuts. My problem is still unsolved. I'm not getting get rid of it. Yes, sir. Share your screen. Sir. We'll try. Yeah, sharing. We cannot test out yet because we need to add the URL. So please wait. Uh, Abhijit, you have an error saying line 18 in module. But I can't see. There should be more things to that error. You have just pasted one part of it. I can't see the rest of the error. So I don't know what is going wrong. I can only know that something is wrong at line 18. Please paste some lines up until the very end of that error. Trace back. Can, can you please, sir? Can you, sir? Can you please use Control Plus to maximize your text? I can't see it. Yeah, I am. Undefined name redirect. What we have to do, sir? One second. I'll paste it in the chat. Give me a okay. minute. Which command you said, sir? Please use Control and Plus sign button to yeah, maximize yeah, yeah. the line text. Eight lines, sir. Problem is with the line number eight. All books. Book dot objects dot all. What is the error? Uh, I will show you the error. Just a moment. Uh, this one fields is equal to title, author name, ISBN number, unmatched. And this is in the forms page. Okay. Yeah, yeah, it's there. Got it. Thank you, sir. Abhijit, for any indentation issues, you need to check your indentation. Make sure it is correct. Make sure your function. After your function, everything is indented. Make sure after your if statement, everything is indented properly. Make sure that your else is corresponding to your if statement, etc., uh, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera, et cetera. You get the point. For people with redirect not defined, I've already put in the chat saying that from Django dot shortcut import render and comma redirect. How to do that? that? You will have to add it to your views dot py at the very top. Oh, I have done that. Import. Uh, yes, book. sir. That is just for other folks who are asking. But I'm getting the error. Undefined title. Sir, yes, I already told you. So you remove the bracket, but your names that you used didn't have quotations. Please add quotation to the name. Okay. Right. That's right. Thing. Right. So uh, we now have book form dot html. We now have use dot py. Anyone still stuck? Mega has an error while the run server is running. Can you please copy paste the error that you get? I'll share the forms.py file a little later. I'll first complete what we are doing. So now go to your URL.py, copy paste the line on top, paste it on the bottom, right? So that you have the yeah, exact I'm same line. Very sorry, I'm uh, I'll share my screen. Yes, I long time no see, so I forgot. But I'm getting an error in class meta. You're getting error in class meta. What is the error? Can you please paste it? Paste Invalid it intact? syntax. Invalid mm -hmm. syntax. Can you uh -huh. paste those few lines, four or five lines in the chat? I'll try to understand what is the invalid syntax. Right. Actually, so you we have, yeah, you, you paste it there. We'll try to see it, come back to it afterwards. Uh, so in your URL.py file, 
go to line number 22 or whichever line you are on where you had passed books take that line copy it paste it on the bottom so you now have a duplicate line so we'll just make quickly changes to it so that we have uh we have a new url so we'll call it new book because we are adding a new book we will change the uh, change the url to new book we we'll change use dot books to use dot what will you call it new book right so use dot new book is a function that i want to trigger i will also give it a name called new book right so do that save it uh basically what you need to be make sure make sure that your url name is properly written make sure that your use dot uh, function name is correct and make sure that the name in the string is correct right so now if you go to your run server and put in new book i will check if my server is running it is not so i'll run it uh i will run the server no such file or directory sorry right my server is running i'll hit enter and i get a very ugly but functional working form all right so now i'll come back to the chat and try to solve out issues for everyone where is the chat right so uh, folks need to create a new url point it to the correct use function and please run your server please uh, open the new url in your browser and it should work fine uh, please again i do not i'm i think i'm repeating this for the fifth or sixth time make sure that the spellings are correct indentation is correct syntax is correct etc uh can you show the url.py file again here it is uh site can't be reached maybe because you are not running the server uh please check if the server is running for harita maybe it is possible that you have your title author name etc etc on a new line is that is that correct is that also happening in your code if it is happening the same way in your code please make it in the same line so fields equal to title author name etc should be in one line sorry it is in same line fields fully i have given in the same line okay and you are saying that it is an error so which line is it pointing to it is to? Giving, uh, pointing to class meta invalid ah, okay sorry yes my mistake so meta should be capital m that is the error still it is showing the same please save and run your server again okay uh, sir there is an extra underscore in the url is dot py sorry the next underscore what's the written syntax sir mm, mr kulkarni is it mm. yes sir no i didn't understand who the person before this was talking to were you talking to me um shrinidhi here yes the this is syntax error in the url is dot py of your url file no uh, in yours in mine okay. uh in my url.py file yeah there there's is an extra a... underscore so which which line can you point me to the the last line the new book line 23 i so there's no extra underscore maybe it, it's For looking sure like that because the screen is rendering that way i don't know i mean this um uh... The first Your, part is it? Can you see the highlighted part? Not there. The next part, the previous part, before the comma. Shouldn't there This be? One. Also, yeah, shouldn't there also be an underscore? No. So you don't need a underscore here because this is the name of the URL. So I could type, okay. let's say, for example, this could be anything. So uh, it could be my book also, and that is the name of that URL pattern that you want. That is okay. just the pattern I think. So now new book will not work. Because it doesn't exist, okay. my book will work. For that, that works. Oh God, I don't want uh, you to. No. Okay. No. Thank you. 
yeah so this will work uh folks who are very still here please just shout out in the chat saying yes or no or whatever people ask me for next steps after book form you need to change the url.py file create a new url like abhijit has mentioned can i share my screen once uh, i'll stop sharing and you can share yours i have already put the link to book form html in the chat please scroll up a bit and check i have called it book form.html and then there is a url you can copy paste the text uh, pretty much simple can everybody uh, people who are telling me that they are done can they see the form on their web page sir error in redirecting so the error is probably that uh, cannot find the name redirect etc please make sure that you imported the correct this thing how do you import you go to views you add this particular line at the top what is the line the line is in the chat okay sir abhijit has a syntax error please paste the error in the chat instead of telling that i have an error please just paste the error and the trace sir back. i have i have already pasted you have your error here which is i think i thought that got sorted out my mistake Where is that? Path books views. New book. No attribute new. Yeah. Yes, that is uh, new attribute new. Okay, if you don't mind, can you please paste it again? I'm trying to scroll up to it, but somebody always pastes yeah, the yeah, message sir. in the I, bottom. Yeah, yeah, sir. I'm putting it again. Yeah. Sir, I have pasted. Path books views. dot new so you have used views dot new dot book it should be views dot new underscore book okay. and please don't use the same URL so you already have a URL called books please call it something else so new book my book something but the first uh, argument which is books slash you already used it once so new underscore uh, book okay and where I need to right. change the URL in the line that you pasted you have used books. Books is the URL that you are already using on the top line, so your Django will get confused between the two URLs if you use the if you use the same URL name. Hmm, that's if you have this, if you have two URLs called book slash, it will be confusing. So call the two different URLs two different names. So no, one is book slash, one call it book new book, right? We'll ah, that is what the one is a books, another one is a new book. Correct. In your pasted code, it looked like books. So I I pointed it out. That's it. Now I have made it now new underscore book the third line, and just above it uh, books common name. Is it okay? Sure. Yeah. Okay. Uh, so can I share my screen? One second. I'll just look through a few things that are showing up. Uh, new book is a syntax error. New book. New book. Invalid syntax. What is showing up as invalid syntax? Uh, so Shashank, you seem to have some some problem with your context variable in your views. Uh, there is one more person who has pasted something with a problem in their views. Somebody wanted to share the screen. They can share the screen. Uh, Abhijit, I guess, had an er error with unbound local error. So he is not assigned the form variable correctly in his views. So that is a problem. What is the error? Can you please show me the error? Sir, can I share my screen once? I didn't understand. Uh, yeah. So, can you please wait? Somebody is already sharing, so you will not be able to share. Sir, it's not recognizing this new book. Can you go to views? Yeah. This new book, right? The name is correct, right? Yes. Okay. Can you run your server and show me your run server page? Yes. So if that error didn't show up in the terminal, then you are fine. Your your uh, your text editor VS Code is just not able to recognize that because it doesn't understand. But okay, it's working fine. Uh, somebody else wanted to share their screen. Abhijit, I'll take your screen share Can after I this. Can I share my screen? Yes. Can I share my screen? For other people who have already been able to see the form, 
please try filling in the form fill all the fields completely and hit submit button it should take you to the uh, page which has the list of books right and it will show you an additional new book that you just added please try that and let me know if it works or not uh, what is the error ma'am that is what i am not able to understand so many things are coming here uh those so many things keep coming ma'am unless it says that there is an error uh, you don't have anything to worry about please go to okay. please go to your web browser put in the url name that you used okay new with the new book okay okay sir can you please try that okay fine you can try that and let me know uh abhijit you can share your screen now okay sir please show me the terminal with the error new book You go fast. Okay, so there's a missing comma. I think. Please go to your URLs and put in the comma. Somebody is asking if the workshop is over. It is way past schedule. Uh, yeah, technically we did overshoot the schedule a bit. Uh, but the idea was that you render the form. So I'll I'll end it for people. Sort of a little more officially, and then I can stay around to solve problems for others. So let me see if my form works properly now. Otherwise, everybody, I'm helping everyone, and yeah, I'm sharing my screen. I know, I know. By now, I learned that I'm not sharing my screen. Yeah, one second, Abhijit. Uh, after second path uh, entry, you have to put comma. Each are comma separated entries. Right. So that should solve the problem for me. Bye bye. Um, I'll share my screen now. Right. So this is how your form looks. It doesn't look very pretty uh, because we are rendering it with the basic setting. But you can actually go uh, if you if you look at um, the Django uh, documentation, you will find ways on how you can render it properly. You can render each field individually also and design it properly in HTML so that they are one after the other, etc. Uh, for now, I just for simplicity sake just pushed in the basic HTML so it renders a little more uglyly. Uh, so I'll type in a new book name. Uh, a new book name would be uh, yeah. So this is another favorite book that I have from Isaac Asimov. Um, Isaac Asimov is the author. The random. As the number, this is sci-fi, and this is about a robot. Okay, submit. Right, and once I hit submit, I should see that there's a third book. If you go to your admin page, you'll also see that a third database entry has been added to your admin as well because it is rendering the same database. So basically, what you've done now is your browser, you. to go to the url my book uh, it sort of shows this text but if i refresh it it will show so uh, this is showing up because this is historically what i typed in but basically what it will show is it will show you an empty form again uh, once i enter some data and hit on submit my browser sends a post request data so i'll try again um, Yes, dear. Yes, dear. Again, again. Again. Um, Hi. And some text. And I'm not sure if you can see this, but let's let's see if I can show you how it works. So in the network tab, once I hit submit, it will show you that it sent a post request, and it got something back, which is the redirect request that it came to book. So I hit. I hit the my book URL with a post request, and then I got a get request for book, which was the redirect. Right. So, uh, so this is what basically happens when I'm submitting a form. Your browser sends a post request uh, that goes to your uh, Django server. The Django server then stored it uh, in the database. So, with the form dot save, what we did was we saved the book to our database, and then. uh the book got rendered when i rendered this page right 
you can play around with that if you want to but uh, yes officially in that sense we have completed one full cycle of what we wanted to do with django we wanted to create an interactive web application uh, create a form create the database create some basic business logic and uh, we we about done that uh, you can what you can do is you can do some exercises like you can create the uh, form for member also on your own and try it out you can uh, add more models if you want to you can add more fancier html and try to edit the html and see how it renders those are some things that you can try on your own but otherwise uh, in general we are done for the day as such and i can stay around for let's say 20 to 30 more minutes and help out with people who are facing issues so in case everything is working fine for you this is about the end of the day and you don't have anything else to do that is new uh, so if you wish to leave for the day you can leave uh, for folks who are facing problems you can stay back and we can help you with the issues i'll stop sharing now Yeah. Okay, sir. Mine, I don't think so it's coming. Mm -hmm. I can share the screen once again. Okay. Yeah, Pratamesh, can you just help her out, and I will come back in a minute. The server is running. So what? What issue? For oh, now, and I should check the server, right? You the web browser here. Yeah. I should go to. I think it's not. Visible over here. How to type local? I should type local host. Only eight thousand new book, right? Right, right, right. Yeah. So local host is coming. One second. Not able to see your web browser. Hmm. Okay, you have entered space with an as an underscore. Okay. Little new book. Little new no, book. No, 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 no. In the template. Template. As you have written form dot as table now, as underscore you have entered a space. Mm, that is why. Okay, in template new book dot html. The html template new book. So I should create another new books html. There I should do this one. Okay, sir. I can miss few steps. I have to. Uh... Me, you have already created new book, right? Html. There is. Another HTML template, right? That is uh, a book yeah, form dot book HTML. Form yeah, book form dot HTML. Yeah, go there. Uh, yeah, uh, as uh, underscore table. You have created a space over there. As as after okay. as as. Yeah, and your form name is n form. No, it is by mistake that tab. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Right. Yeah, you can save that, and now it should work. Okay, sir. I'll stop sharing. Sir, hello. Yeah, yeah. Uh, when I uh, use it on this local host eight thousand, only I am able to see the books. If I go to the books, no, not the list. I don't know where the problem is. Oh, uh, okay. Uh, Can I share my screen? Yeah, sure, sure, sure. Yeah. Is it visible, sir? Mm, yes, yes. Yeah, only it is showing books. Mm. Okay, can you go to your views? Yeah, just a moment. So, have you already added the data, like I recommended uh, last time? Yeah, just I will show that also. Uh, is this is a view file, sir? Hmm. Okay. All right, and uh, I'm yeah, showing I the see. data. Yeah. That why I need to go to the admins then. Where I need to add the data? Oh, books, books. There is no book book model itself. No, it is not showing. Yeah, you have to register book model in the admin dot py. Okay, then it will show up over here. Then you can add, and then just, just a minute. Yeah, copy that line. Yeah, this one. Yeah, and paste and it. Change it to book instead of member book. Yeah. Okay. B capital. Yes, yes. No, no, no. Not like this. Mm -hmm. Only book. Okay. I will yeah. see. 
this much is required only yeah this much is much yeah it will work okay. yeah anyone else i will so stop if i'm entering some data in the form automatically it will get save no save button or anything nahi no, submit is there na no? you will have to submit um sir i would i would like to share my screen yeah sure okay. yes i have this no such column for author name Mm -hmm. no, so you can show your model not given. Right? You don't have an author name column. Ah, so don't use that anyway. Yeah, it's not there. Is there? No. Yeah, it's there. It's, it's uh, book author underscore name. Show your forms. Can you show your forms? Yeah, models. Models start here. So yeah, can you show the error again? Maybe she added later and yeah, yeah, yeah. So I rerun the yeah, you need to close the close the server, Control C or other. Can you run Python manage dot py make migrations? Press enter. Oh, you renamed something to something, no? So that is why that error shows up. Okay. Was book author? Yes. Was LSBN? Yes. Right. Okay. Now you have to run migrate. Python manage dot py migrate. general queries uh, the the modules on yes should be available for about a week or two more uh, you can refer to those uh, about certification unfortunately we are not aware uh, mega can share her screen if she wants to i guess she is sharing okay after this sir, mega in this share. case sir in this case i made uh, manually this input uh, is for take the value Correct. right but you'll have to add all the fields because uh, what will happen is uh, when your new function gets all your data it will only contain name and author so uh, so your other fields will be empty and in your models it will throw an error so which is why we were using the as table uh, you can take some time to do this it will take some time in the sense that you will have to add all the fields You have to make sure that all the fields are getting passed to your new function correctly, etc. You also have to add the CSRF token in this case also. So your CSRF token should be present always. So you can try that as a okay. sort of an assignment at home if you want to. Uh, but you need to make sure that everything, all the fields are present because in your models all the fields are mandatory. So even if you open your admin dot py. In your admin dot py, if you don't enter one field, it will it will start crying that you know you you left this field empty. This is why all fields yeah, are right. Uh, okay. Can we let uh, Megha share her screen, please? You can share your screen, and you can tell me the error. Template does not exist. Is the problem right? Now it shows up. Okay, good. I am guessing I solved it. Anyone else facing issues? You can. You yes, can sir. Just once. Uh, I am getting the form now, but submit option is not coming. That's the last problem. What I. So then your HTML may be a little different or incorrect. Please check. 
please compare yeah, with the input uh, input uh, type submit and then value equal to submit right i have pasted the html file in the chat you can check there oh sorry one second yeah. sorry sorry i pasted it in the wrong place yeah here it is uh abhijit has asked that the indentation error is not going it is not going because there is something other than that error that is showing up so either while adjusting your original indentation error something else is going wrong you should always check the line number of the error trace back that shows up so if you are changing something please check which line number it is showing up on uh try to fix it yourself and then we'll see so i think so dr kulkarni also wanted to share something sir just i wanted to know actually we did not get time to go through the videos of uh, more, some videos we saw from the day one but today we did not get time so videos to videos will be available about one week, one or two weeks from now you can see go and look okay thank you sir i thought that uh, today we will close the link thank you sir ankit sir yes ma'am uh, sir uh, if we do uh, within the mean period time if you want to go through all the modules of your uh, uh, Jan uh, django and uh, python content Uh, if we don't get that time period to uh, to have a view of this videos, what uh, Yaksh has, so is there any other portal where IIT his, uh, has posted these all videos on YouTube where the links are there, which is coming from YouTube? Can One you tell me? I will check and tell you. Because if Yaksh portal is closed within a week or so. we will not be able to uh, at least view and get referrals from the uh, content also no that would, the portal is very good so that if we can have that for uh, at least a month or so that would be great but uh, and uh, it would it would not be uh, that uh, one week's time would not be sufficient to go through yes, everything sir. thoroughly yes yes because we also have other tasks at our hand so i mean we can uh, cannot devote entire week to this particular task only so i'm sorry it's not still coming can i show my share my screen one second if you don't know okay should i show the html code sir this is how it's coming yes this is the html code so what is the issue uh, the when i'm going to the form that submit yeah. button is not coming i'll show you the Can you remove the part on top, the part that is showing up on top? Just remove that. Okay, that is when I am opening a new file. That's okay. Coming. Just remove it now and save it. Okay. So should I break and then again do? No, no, no. Just refresh the web page. Yeah, I am done. Okay, it is still not correct, right? No, that submit as an option. It is not coming. Can you show me the HTML again and please hit Control Plus? I I think we can maximize to see what is going on. Find method post. Here are the button. Use double brackets there. Use double brackets on CSRF token. No, that is correct. Uh, just remove the space between percentage and curly braces. That is one. Uh, I don't think that yeah. is cause problem, but form method post. Wait one second. Let me check. Form method post slash form input type should work. Please save and just try again. Input tag hasn't closed, I think. Input tag. No input tag. Don't need close. Uh, still not working. Sorry, I didn't notice the page. No, I think page? it's not working. No. So now we got rid of the CSRF token. Can you remove the space between your arrow and input? Arrow and input. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Here, space matters. Thank you, sir. It's coming now. 
Abhijit, most probably you do you not imported book form in your file. Please import it first and then check. Uh, Dinidhi is saying that the browser or the admin page is not getting updated. Please refresh the page or please make sure that your run server is running in a terminal. Then go back to your admin and please uh, press refresh. Thank you for attending. Uh, it was great to I have you. I just me. ask one doubt. Suppose here yeah. we have non library management system. Uh, if I want to Correct. do something, suppose railway booking system or something. So there, how will you get help, help from Django? Like as a common user when I'm not under FOSSIS. So then only your database design will change. Some of your forms will change. Your URLs may be different. But for example, let's say you are doing a data, uh, you are doing a railway booking system. You need a form to submit your request. You need uh, a model to store all your trains. Uh, you need some scheduling sort of model to store your schedule. So it will be a little more complex than this, but but it is the same basic concepts. Just that you build on top of them to sort of allow you to store the data yeah, and I should do the, the modification in this library management system only. I should do the no, no, or no, it is already something is project. there. Yeah. Huh, okay. Start new there, project. Okay. Because that will be completely different. That will not be something similar to this. So you will have different yes, tables, different database. You need different URLs. So already something is there in Django which I'll be able to like use like here how I'm using library management or I have to start from scratch. No, so like you did in this case, right? You'll create a new app called train ticket booking system. You create a new project, you'll create a new app, you'll add new models. So same process you will follow, but you'll you do it little differently because you want to store different information. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Hello, sir. Yes. Am sir. I audible? I'm not able to yes. find out my form where to fill it. I tried it several times. So URL.py did you fill in? Yeah, just I'm showing you. Uh, in URL uh, file, na? Yeah, it's filled. I'm I'm showing you. Yeah. There is some other problem. See, is my screen visible, sir? Yes, sir. Yeah. So I told you first that you have two URLs called books. So you yeah, have to have, have different names. Yeah, those I have. But you can't call the same URL books, no? You have books for one we have books for the second one also both are called books yeah like, yeah this is the problem yeah so what i need to write here new books just write any other name different name that you can remember okay and uh, please show me your server so open this url in your browser and then show me your server page yeah i will i will do it one more time No, it is yes, showing but, error. But sir, you typed something different in URL.py, sir. You, yes, your name nice. there was something else. Achha, capital new. Yes, sir. No, still showing okay. the error. That is still error change. So that is good news. Yeah, good now, uh, now you have template does not exist. So yeah. you need to copy paste this template, which I'm pasting in the chat. Yeah. Uh, so this one HTTP. No, the link that I gave, please copy the contents into new underscore uh, book dot html which which html file did you add in your views dot py just in a time showing ah. 
is it visible sir new book what is the name bookform.html right and please create a bookform.html in the same folder where books.html was created no i did i did not understand you have a folder where books.html was already created can you please open that folder yeah in library manager or this something this one this one same 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 folder you were there only yeah now create a new file here called book what is that name go back to the view.py forget the name also yeah ha huh. it is called bookform.html just create that in that folder and copy that content of that link that i gave you yeah yeah and it should work it should be text file na no? it should be html file okay i will do one thing yeah just save this as a here only library manager correct no 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 go into templates go into library manager again go library manager template library manager again now here you will save it as a dot html and save it as an html file yeah save okay please paste the content of that link that i sent you i'll send it again if you want me to yeah just a moment where is that link missing in the chat in the chat yeah yeah this one no it has to be open with save it hmm now uh, refresh that page in the browser which you got error no i have to go to the server first na no no it's already Sorry. running okay so go to the press enter again yeah submit okay so it is showing submit yeah but it is not showing the form can you please show me your views.py yeah views.py has form request contact form.save can you show me your template again please yeah can you open it here only fine no problem oh why is it showing up like this oh you opened it in the browser that is all can you open yeah. it in spider only can you yeah yeah okay. i will open it in spider template hmm form dot as table oh god i can't see the text html form csrf token form as table can you show your views dot py again yeah hmm and can you refresh the html page again sorry on the browser i don't understand why this is going wrong no, no idea hello sir shall i refresh it can you please refresh the browser page yeah no form dot it has to be new form na no new book is correct new book is correct yes I don't know if Prasanna is still there. He has an idea. Yeah, I'm there. I'm there. Yeah. Do you have idea why this is happening? Uh. We have new error also. Wait. Book form doesn't take argument. Can you please press press refresh again? Hmm. This will be something in views. Ah, uh, but. Okay, go to forms. dot py. Maybe forms. dot py is something fun. Hmm. Book form. 
yes so book form should bracket the class book form open bracket model form close bracket where where sir line number 5 class yeah. book form open yeah. bracket okay hmm then model form that you see on line number 1 please add same spelling there in 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 the same model form on line number 1 that you see please add that into that bracket uh, wait i will paste the line completely for you once no 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 i will do that in book form na no? i will paste it you can is it okay you want to compare so you can compare with the chat line class book form and model form in bracket Okay. Yeah, book form, model form in bracket, right? Correct. Now save it, and now you can refresh your uh, web page, and it should show. No, just uh, ah, now it is showing. Thank God. So you Thanks. can enter everything and and submit it. Uh, I think uh, with that. on a good note we can end the session here so thank you for cooperating it was interesting to sort of help you folks figure out django i hope you had a good learning session uh, sorry for overshooting the time but i hope you had a good time thank you so much uh, the folks at e studio Can you please stop recording, and you can also stop the Zoom session for now. Yeah, one second. Uh, one uh, Shruti has some issue. We'll just see it once, and then we'll stop it. Sorry, what was it? Who was it? Shruti. Shruti wants to share. She has some issue. Um, Me, me, or Shruti, or someone, whoever. Yeah, 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 yeah. So yeah, yeah. So books are not showing up. Can you go to? You have used. Please open your template. Template will be here. Template file books. dot html. Can you please open that? Mm -hmm. For my book in all books, my book. Ella. Okay. Have you entered the data in your admin page? Was the books already entered? Not this. Add books. Uh, uh, add books to the admin page. No, no. One second. One second. Books, not book. The spelling mistake. In template. No, it's over here. Yeah. No. 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 So then, admin, me, कुछ add ही नहीं किया होगा. So admin, please open your admin interface. Add some books, and then they will show up here. No, no, no. If you no, don't no. have anything in your database, then nothing will show up here. Yeah. Go right. to admin. So local host slash admin. No, no, no. On the web browser, save this file or save that admins. dot py. It's not saved. So just two minutes. Yeah. Tab. Um. Admin. You're not running your server. You're not running your server. Books is not defined. Boss, read. Hmm. Boss, it is not saved. No, admin dot py. Please save file in your text editor. Please save. Save. Control S. Control S. Save. Yes. Now refresh. Now refresh the uh, web browser. No, no, run the server. She has stopped it. <laughs> Stop the server. Okay, run the server first in the terminal. Right. Now, once you are running, now refresh the page. Now go to books. It is there. Okay. So show your views. dot py in your text editor. Right. So this is all books, all books, all books, all books. Book dot object dot org. Maybe here. 
भी है और जी हाँ तो मेरा टेम्पलेट अगेन इन मैक्सिमाइज योर विंडो लॉट्स ऑफ स्पेस यूज बुक्स डॉट एस्टीमेंट हाँ करेक्ट ओके सो दैट सेम बुक्स डॉट एस्टीमेंट कैन यू प्लीज ओपन इन योर एक्सीमेंट और माय बुक इन ऑल बुक्स माय बुक एलआई एंड फॉर इट शुड शो अप नो यस यस आई थिंक इट विल शो प्लीज रिफ्रेस दैट दैट यूआरएल अगेन नॉट दिस वन द बुक स्लैश बुक या एंटर एंटर इट लॉट ऑफ कंप्लीट यस गुड नाइस वर्किंग Thank you, sir. Yeah, thanks. I think yeah, Ankit, we can stop. I think.